giving you a demo today for Predix Edge. We're going to show how to enroll an Edge virtual machine in our Edge management tool. So I've got two web browsers here. On my right, I've got what we call the Predix Edge Technician Console. This is a local web administration tool for a Predix Edge virtual machine or gateway, in this case a virtual machine. You can see on the top it says Predix Edge Technician Console. And then on my left, similar UI, common experience, we have the Predix Edge Management Tool. So this Edge Management Tool is served up from our Predix Cloud. It's a software as a service for remotely managing devices. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to add a new device. So we're going to go to click that Add button. We're going to give the device a name. We'll call it Edge Demo. Give it a device ID. We'll give it a shared secret that we confirm. And we're going to give it access to the Predix time series and event hubs uh, services. We can skip this and finish. So we've now created a new record in Device Manager. There's also a tool to bulk upload devices if you're adding many at a time, but this just shows how to do one. So then we go over to the device status. Oh, we're just going to copy one URL from here. This is the URL for the Edge Management Tenant. So it's conveniently right there. <clears throat> now in here, we go to this Enroll button. And we have to say what the device ID is. So again, remember it was Edge Demo. We'll paste that enrollment URL, type in our shared secret, and click the Enroll button. Success. Certificate enrollment success. Great. So the device successfully enrolled. And now we'll see this change to offline in one second as the device calls back. Great. Now the device is showing up as offline. And in just a moment, it will switch to online as it uh, calls back with its sync interval. There it is, online. In the next demo, we're gonna launch APM, show that there's no data there, then from Edge Manager, we'll deploy uh, some applications and some configurations, and we'll see the data appearing in the APM tool.